Hello everyone, this is Nana, and I'm here with little Landon. He's fixing to get dressed to head home to his mommy. This is one of my creations. He's a little bald baby. He's got a beautiful bald head. Pretty heavy. Mom wanted him pretty heavy. Here's his little feet. And he's got these little hands. Super cute. Super cute. So we're going to get him dressed so I can get him ready to go home. Now I had... Let's put your hat back on, Landon. Let's put your hat back on. Little guy. Oh, he just looks so cute with his hat on. You guys didn't see his face. Like I said, he's super heavy. He's weighing about 8 pounds. 8.3 8. I think is what his weight is. So he's a bigger baby. He's got some nice movement in his limbs. He's uh, full limbs and full legs. I think he's about 22 inches long. The real born linen kit. Now I had this little outfit on him. And it's only three months. And it is pretty small. So I had to go get him something different to our home. So I think I'm going to put this little romper on him. Uh, to send him home in and I, and I got him a little pair of red socks because the little Mickey Mouse shorts are red. And we're going to put this in his box uh, for his mom that he can take that home with him. I did get his COA done. Uh, it's right here. COA. It's got my seal of approval right there. That's going to be going home with him as well. And I did his sister too. So he's got a sister over there that I'm going to be, well, she's already dressed, so I'm just going to show her to you. But I thought that I would get him ready and we can get him wrapped up in his new blanket with the dinosaurs. And we can send him home, hopefully tomorrow, if the full service is open. The rain did stop about 5 o'clock this morning. Um, so... It's had a whole day to dry out out there. I haven't been to town, so I don't know what kind of shape the town is in. Um, but I know the rain stopped, so that's got to be a good sign. And um, we still don't have a lot of traffic on our street. That kind of tells me that not a lot of people are out and about yet. So I gave him some eyelashes. And he's got these beautiful eyebrows. I really like the way he turned out. I really enjoyed painting this kit. He's a bigger baby, so I think maybe that's why I enjoyed it a little bit more. Yes, three to six months seems like it's going to fit him pretty good. I didn't have any three to six months boys clothes. And I knew this was a like a t-shirt type material, so it was going to give a little bit, but it looks super cute on him. Don't he look adorable? He's so heavy. He's so heavy. But it fits him good between uh, the neck and the crotch. It fits him nicely and, and he has a little bit of room in it. He doesn't look like he's choking in his clothes. So we have a nice little socks we're going to put on him. And of course they fit perfectly and look super cute with his outfit. And we're going to send him home with that little hat that he had on. It's a shame I couldn't find a Mickey Mouse hat. But this one is kind of kind of cute. I like it. And it matches his clothes. So I'm going to send him home with that hat. So we'll get his blanket opened up. Let me see if I can set him up here. You guys can see him. While we get his blanket out. Can you see? It is evening time. The sun has gone down. And as you guys know, I have terrible lighting in my living room. 
I have good lighting over my desk. Tyler brought me in a really nice uh, long fluorescent light that I use over on the desk. But it just washes the babies out, but it's good to paint with. I'm very painting underneath that light. Alright, look at him, isn't he sweet? He is so cute. And here's his little blanket, so I'm going to open it up and we're going to get him all wrapped up. Got his blanket all done it out, and I got all the sticky things off of it, those little plastic things that they put the tags on with it. I'm going to send him home with this pacifier. Um, it has a little car on it, super cute, and it looks so adorable on him. I did use a very large, heavy-duty magnet for his pacifier, so it's not going to go anywhere. Any cute. So we're going to get him wrapped up in his blanket and get him ready to go home to see his mommy. I cannot wait to hear what his mom thinks about him. I, I think he's super adorable. And this is a little trick that I learned from Jackie Ortiz's channel. Um, about their eyelashes. So I'm going to try to put that over his face and put this around the back of his head and I hope that that keeps the blanket up off of his eyelashes because I, I'd be devastated if something happened to him. And root to see his mom. So I'm going to try to take this Around his eyes, it's just, um, uh, what do you call this? Tissue paper. Just tissue paper. You're going to hear some fireworks because my neighbors are rude. <laughs> I'm going to have to tell Tyler to break out his fireworks. Go out there and have a war. War with neighbors. I can't, every year on 4th of July, it is just... A little bit crazier every year and our our big dog our big girl that we just lost um, was terrified fireworks so we'd have to bring her inside she didn't she didn't mind though she was okay as long as she was around her family and inside but those fireworks are terrible they're not supposed to sell the big ones here well they don't but we are so close to Mexico, they can just go over to Mexico and get the very large fireworks that we're not allowed to have. And that is what you hear around here. Most of the time, are the big cannons. Alright. That's on his face, and I hope that protects his little eyelashes. See? It looks like he had eye surgery or something. Well, he did. He got eyelashes, so it is eye surgery. So his old dinosaur is over here, and I just put him, you know, in the blanket at each corner. I'm gonna fold this part up first, and we're gonna fold this one down. They kind of come together there in the middle. Then I drape this one over. I'll grab his little arm and we'll just stuff this one up underneath of his body like so kind of wanted it where his dinosaur hung out on his leg and we'll bring that one over and we'll wrap that one around his little body and we'll wrap up his head and his little feet he's got this beautiful plush blanket to go home in Save the ribbon off of the blanket. I'm gonna put that up underneath of him. And find about the middle. And just tie that in a sweet little bow. So he's going home like a cute little birthday bag. And we got his little bow here. He look adorable. 
So this is what his mom will see when she opens up her little package for me. I wanted that dinosaur to kind of set out. I may have to rewrap him so his little dinosaur sets out a little bit more. But this is little Landon and he's headed home. So welcome to the world, little Landon, and I hope your mom loves you. I hope she loves you as much as I love you. So we hope that you enjoy your precious little boy to our new mom out there. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this um, reveal of my version of the London kit. I have three more babies to share with you. So keep coming back and watch the next video so you can see the babies coming out. Take care everyone. Have a good night.